Hey guys, happy Saturday. Oh my goodness, I am here with Breezy. And I am so thankful and relieved to say that fall is truly here. Well, maybe not truly, truly. <laughs> but it definitely is coming. And it definitely is cooler. I mean, I'm still in my t-shirts. But I'm happy to be in jeans. And excuse my voice. I was <laughs> I was eating some spicy chips, so <laughs> they're just so delicious I couldn't help it. So my eyes are trying not to water anymore, but I have Breezy and she is so beautiful and so calm and I push her back into her sleeper which I love. I love her in her original sleeper that she came with and this bonnet. And I put her in this bunting bag that I had I had for a long, long time. So <laughs> she is so cozy. Oh my goodness, she looks so nice and warm. Um, I came here to talk to you a little bit about um my crafts. Now, see, this is. <laughs> this is what I made a while ago and I have this in pictures with Breezy and the thing is she is wearing a beautiful green ensemble and this pink I would love if I could be matchy match and have everything together so I love this whole thing for her except for this little pink bead I would love to make her one with a green bead. Now, the only <laughs> green beads that I have. Oh, look, they do match. I wasn't sure. So, I'm pretty sure. I love the look of the square. I have more of these honey comb type or beehives. But I really wanted... Well, they, there are two different shades of green. Oh, oops. <laughs> there are two different shades, slightly different shades. There's a darker green. Oh, and I see a broken bead. There are the two different shades. If you can see. Yay, the lighter bead <laughs> will work with her. But <clears throat> I don't know if I have any light. There's no square beads. There's a honeycomb. Oh, there was a square bead, but oh, well, that's no fun. There's this light. This is what I wanted, the light one, but it broke. I'm sure. So anyways, that is my plan. I would love to make another one of these. I'm, I'm running out of these kind of clips, though. I think I might have one more. So I'd love to remake this because I also love this pink one. I made this pink one for lavender. She, lavender is my copied baby. Yes, my copied baby. Um, so this goes awesome with her outfit. She's wearing a vintage um, looking outfit. And I love this outfit of Breezy. Oh, she, is, she looks so comfortable. Oh, you look so comfy. <laughs> beautiful so that's my plan for today I would love to make um, another pacifier clip but with a bean bean so I can match this outfit because I love this outfit on her these will be her sleeper set for sure let's see if I can oh she 
Good thing she won't cry on me because she's too cold. I love this outfit on her. It's like, um, it's a pants set with the top. And the feet are like has feet. But I love this like vintage string. And oh, she smells so good. I put, I put a one away for in her diaper, but peeking up. And she's also wearing like a vintage diaper cover. Like not a onesie. Oh, she smells so good. I think it's perfect. When you take those Wonder Wafers out, they are <clears throat> extremely strong. But when you put them in the diaper, oh, it's just a perfect amount of scent. Perfect. <laughs> oh, she's so beautiful. So this is breezy. I love her. So guys, I have been back at work. I had a full week at work and it was so fun and lovely. <laughs> it actually is lovely to be back at work. Um, I did post a few pictures of my kids on my Instagram. Uh, my Instagram is not public. It's um, only a few people follow me on Instagram. Um, but so I won't be showing them their faces on YouTube. However, I did mention in my Instagram that the post where I got them from is a public Facebook group. So my school where I teach and I have been teaching since 2002, yes, 20 years ago, <laughs> um, it's the same community. This is like the very first school I taught in in that community is now burned. It burned back in 2007. And um, and then we had to actually teach in what's called portables. And there are different houses. So it's like class houses. So like grade ones were in that house grade twos were in a house um the bathrooms there were no bathrooms in the class houses bathrooms were outside in a separate like it was a mobile home it turned into like stalls and like they were flushable they had sinks they had running water they had plumbing um but it was a separate house so they had a separate bathhouse separate class houses they had a, a big house for a gym they had a big place for a library they had a separate music house and they had a separate art house oh a separate a separate office house and staff room well the office and the staff room was in the uh, okay I'm, i get easily distracted sorry she looks so sweet Look how she cuddles. Oh, breezy. <laughs> breezy has painted hair and she has rooted hair. So she has combination hair. Which I bet you when I take this off, it'll be so messy. So anyways, we were in the portables for... I don't know, a few years, actually. Um, this is her hat. This <laughs> messy little hat head. Oh, my goodness. Look at this face. Oh. <laughs> oh, she's so beautiful. Mm, she smells so good. Um, <laughs> what was I saying? <laughs> Ah, I get easily distracted. I can't believe it. I'm pretty sure that if I was born in the 2000s, I would be diagnosed with ADHD. I'm pretty sure of it. <laughs> um, okay, so it was really interesting being in classes. When they opened the new school where I teach now, it's a giant school. Um, each class or sorry, each grade has two class, two classrooms. Wait, I am just rambling. 
Oh, she is so sweet. But she seems cold. I am so happy that fall is here. It's like, I love doing chores without sweating so much. <laughs> like carrying up the laundry without sweating so much. Um, oh, she's a heavy girl. Okay, I'm going to have to put her hat on another time. But yes, I would love to make her a passy clip that will match her green outfit. So I'll look in that uh, bead bag and see if I have anything. Um, if I can't use a square one, I'd probably use one of the beehive ones. So to me, I don't know, just for something different. I also want to mention that um, these, these beads that Jenny recently gifted me, um, they're beautifully colored, but they're actually, they're big. They're bigger than the ones that I've been using. So, they're slightly bigger. Wait, I can use open these. Um, I guess it's not that big of a difference. But yeah, I guess it is. Because, I mean, if I put them in like these... They're going to be quite big, quite big for this project. So I was thinking I would love to make like a, a teether rattle out of these. Because they're big enough. These ones are kind of small, but these ones are big enough to make like those baby rattles with the smaller rings. I don't have one that right here. But anyways, guys, I hope that you have a great day. Thank you so much for joining me. Spend some time with your dolls. I hope that you have some time to spend with yourself and your hobby and your dolls. And have some peaceful moments. Until next time, guys, very, very soon. Take care. Thank you for being here. Match hand, guys. Match hand. Bye, guys. Love you. Bye.